snipers ain't playing We be about money, all of it Chasing that check like it's those sun Start running, lifers ain't playing We be about money, all of it Chasing that check like it's those sun Start running, Just to cap that shepherd land Put it on skate Alright, what's going on people? This is about as good a time as any To uh, make this third trick of the trade video As I am currently Eastbound on 76 through Pennsylvania. Been climbing this grade for quite a while. Now let me show y'all. You see my temperature gauge. It's pretty high. Normal operating range is right around the 200 mark. So, in order to cool it down and avoid obviously the engine overheating and potentially. Messing the radiator up, blowing it out, whatever it is. Uh, what I do is I turn the heat. Well, I turn the heat on. I turn it all the way as far to the red as it will go, and I have it on full blast out the vents, which allows the heat that's trapped in the engine compartment to escape, thus lowering the uh, internal temperature of the engine. Now, where I got that from was from my freshman year of high school, I took auto tech, and my teacher, he asked the class, if your car is overheating, you know, what, what can you do to cool the engine down so that you can make it to either a safe, uh, safe place to pull over, or potentially to a uh, service center, to an auto shop. And of course, us being uh, you know, ninth graders, no driving experience, most of us very little to none at all, uh, mechanical experience, and throwing out every answer but the right answer. You know, the most common answer was actually, turn the AC on. Everybody else, now turn the AC on, that's, that's actually the, the worst thing you can do. The AC will cool you down, but it actually is adding more work onto the engine, so. He said, you know, you turn, you turn your heat on, and you have it coming on full blast on all your vents, and the engine will cool down enough for you to keep driving. So when I was out here um, in my uh, TNT phase as a uh, trainee, I ended up climbing a, not California, ended up climbing a grade, and approaching the grade, there was a sign that said, Turn off your AC prior to starting the ascent to avoid engine overheating and you know, potentially blowing out your radiator. So I followed the advice. I had never seen anything like that before. And about halfway up the grade, I see I started seeing trucks pulled over on the side of the road with their engines, uh, with their um, hoods open. So clearly their engines had overheated. Saw a couple trucks where. They had actually moved the radiator out and they were leaking uh, antifreeze all over the side of the road. And at that point, that's when I noticed that my temperature was getting kind of high. So, the first thing that came to my mind was what my auto tech teacher told me. I did it, it worked, and I've done it ever since. So, there you go. That's uh, trick of the trade number three. If I can think of any more, I'll definitely. Uh, video about it and share that with you all, but something that you can do to avoid your engine overheating and your climbing grades, just turn the heat on, put the windows down, and of course continue to monitor the temperature gauge, but that usually works for me, I haven't had an issue um, the entire time I've been out here, so um, yeah, there you go. So take that piece of information, internalize it, utilize it, and I'll be hollering at y'all on the next one. As always, until next time, I'm going to be found.